Hello, I'm Simon from Buffy Pyro, and this is my 7 of 20. 12. Uh, 7. Uh, number 6. Uh, 23. Um, 21. 29. Uh, 18, please. Ooh. If I could have dinner with anyone in the world, who would it be? Daniel Day Lewis. I, I, I admire him for so many reasons, and uh, yeah, and I think he'd be great fun. He could handle a drink probably because he's Irish, and yeah, I just love his work. I'd love to pick his brain, and I don't know anything about him. So, Daniel, please be my dinner day. Uh, sadly, the last time I cried was a couple of weeks ago. Oh, it's probably only a week ago now. Our poor friend from Frightened Rabbit, Scott. Uh, unfortunately. Yeah, anyway, it was, it was about losing a friend a week or so ago, and uh, yeah, and it's it's not nice, so it wasn't like a fun <laughs> cry, or it was uh, a necessary cry, so yeah, love you, Scott. Oh, it's probably chicken bone, when we were in Japan, I, I'm quite adventurous when it comes to food, so I'm happy to eat anything, but we, we got this plate of kind of innards and things, and it's great to eat all parts of the, the animal, but I don't want to ever eat soft chicken bone ever again, it was repulsive oh when was the last time I yelled at some unfortunately I probably yelled at my wife the other day because I was sleeping upstairs and uh, she didn't have her keys at the back door and she was banging I thought someone was breaking into the house I woke up in a cold sweat thinking we were getting a home invasion and it's, I was like who the fuck is that and it was it was my wife so sorry baby my entire existence <laughs> no, I don't know. I'd, I'd choose to be a better singer. I'd choose to not smoke and I'd choose to be a better singer because that's I'm really not a confident natural singer. So if I could do anything, I would do that because my life would be a shit ton easier. <laughs> yes, I do. I do. Um, I'm happy for people to not believe in the concept of marriage, but I'm happily married. I found my one and only. And uh, yep, but I don't give a shit if you don't. It's a personal view and it doesn't affect anyone else. So yeah, but yes, I do. The worst present I've probably ever received, I'm not, I'm not going to name but it, but see when you get a piece of art art or something like that that someone chooses on your behalf, it's quite hard to do that. So yeah, I guess it's probably a painting I got once that, that really is not was not something that I was at all into. That's it, I sound really ungrateful. So uh, yeah, I guess I'm just fucking ungrateful, but no, no, all gifts are amazing. Love them all. This, this question does not apply 